Hi, good morning, everybody. Um, I'm going to try and do a bar video once a week. Um, no promises, but uh, that's going to be the goal. My son says hello. All right, so this morning what I'm going to do, and I'm pretty sure that you can't see my mouse, um, but I can light things up on here so you can see that the, the greasy clockwork lights up. So let's say this, so this is a polling method um, that I used in Rift Seeker Sanctum to hold down a lot more named uh, or PHs than you're probably supposed to be allowed to to do, uh, to hold down. So, um, so basically like if you know that, so you have like the name mobs, uh, on your map so you kind of know where they're at you have your track um, of course is is up and running so when their name pops up um, you know where they're gonna be at right well, there's there it is <laughs> I uh, revamped my my hotbar key it was getting too crowded for my, my hotbar stuff so now I have trouble finding things <laughs> Um, anyways, so if you do consider, then it'll just put the mobs that are the highest level at the top. Um, so obviously that's typically going to be where your the named spawns that you want is going to be. So I used to have my track. I, I, I kind of revamped my UI, so it's a little, a little wonky right now. Anyway, so let's say you get your, your namer to spawn that you want to go get, but there's a bunch of, so like in RSS, it's a very corridor-like, um, it's a lot of like tunnels like this. So the pulling method that I use for it is, is I'll just, I'll run to the mob wherever it's at. We'll just say it's like, it's like this obsolete right here and I'll fade to it, right? So now I have it. And what I'll do is as I'm running back, I'll just I'll just mez all of the things like as I make my way back um, to the camp. And and get the mob to just like single down that way. Right? So if originally this obsolete model was the one that I wanted. So now I have them all mezzed, and then I'll just fade, and now I have the name single. So um, when it gets a little bit more precarious, uh, Rift Seeker Sanctum, the tunnel's a little wider, and the and the mob level is not quite as dense, even though the mo uh, sorry the amount of mobs is not quite as dense, but the uh, the mob levels are higher. Um, so you can get a little tricky with it. You can add in like um, invulnerability song. Um, what you could do if, so let's say, and then I'll, I'll end on this. Um, but let's say that, hold on. Let's say that you, I'm trying to think, um, like you can't, it's, it's not that, easy to uh i don't know it, it's it's just another thing that you can do so so what you can do is you can pick up high sun you can pick up high sun and actually now that i'm thinking about it there's actually another thing you can do so actually i'm gonna do this this sounds fun it's so crazy like having played bard for the 20 you know the two decades plus that i have and i still i'm still like oh yeah i could do that um so i'm i'm probably this is probably something that i would do because i'm a little crazier than most uh in the limit testing but as i've said in a previous video you you, you have your singing steel greaves that do um the appalling screech but for whatever reason this doesn't seem to have a level cap on the things that it can fear so i might it, it, if i had like a dense pole where it's really hard for me to like separate all of the things i would probably do this right i just get 
I get all of the mobs, and like there's a bunch of them, and I and I can't. There's like too many to do the mez method. So what I would do is probably in Voln Song right now, right? So right now I would be in vulnerable for 12 seconds, and this way I can group up all of the mobs. And then when that 12 seconds runs out, I would hit my death dance. And then I would mez the mob that I want to keep. And then I would hit the fear um, pants. Hit the fear pants, they run away. And then I hit fade. Or maybe I have to wait to hit fade for when their fear wears off. I don't, I'm not sure if... Uh, this one I want to keep though. You stay. You stay. And fade the rest. And now I get a single. So the bard's crazy like that. Like it, there's a lot of. I mean, obviously that's a big fat cooldown. Um, using the death dance method, but it's a thing that you could do. Um, and I'll sh I'll show you some more advanced stuff later. Uh, like. Uh, the how, how I and I think I did a video already but it was how I, I soloed one of the 1.5 named mobs because all the mobs summoned so I had to get a little tricky with with what I did for that but maybe I'll do that one next week anyways cheers um we'll do another one next week